I have a very, 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 very thick leggings. Good morning guys, so I'm getting ready, I need to head to the bank, this my the time is past 10, I really need to hurry, so the weather is actually currently minus 14 guys, I have, you know when they say shoti dira, I don't dira, <laughs> guys, I have like, my underwear i have this thermal whatever from dollarama it's not thick but like it will do and this one is very cozy this particular sweater or sweatshirt or whatever it's very cozy it has this fleece collar i got it from valley village when we first landed <laughs> and it's one of my favorite sweaters and underneath these jeans i have a very 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 thick leggings so i'm covered and this thick as uh jeans and for socks i doubled my socks guys i don't like the cold so i think i am ready i just need to need to put on my shoes and then we head out Air out my airport. Airport, I missed the bus and the next one is coming and this is why Toronto is superior guys <laughs> this is why I'm gonna miss Toronto so I missed the bus by just like one minute and now I have to wait like another 27 minutes or 30 minutes for the next bus so I decided to walk Alexa stop I just got back. Oh my god, I walked, guys. I would, if I had waited for the bus, this would have been the same time that I would get in here. But like, I would have had to wait at the bus stop in the cold for 27 minutes. So I decided to just keep it moving. I just walked. Oh my goodness. Ah, and today I experienced what I feel is close to like frostbite. I have never experienced frostbite, but like the rate at which the cold was eating my face, I started to feel like tiny pinches. Very, it was not intense, but like tiny pinches. I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, what's happening to my face? So I had to rewrap my 
scarf to bury at half of my face like my cheeks and my nose oh my goodness now this is winter <laughs> now this is winter so the thing is in this part the buildings are not you know in toronto we have lots of high rise buildings and you know they're not sparsely um populated but this place is the, uh, the buildings are lower and that they are not as densely populated as the buildings in Toronto. Oh, guys. So uh, this is Mississauga. I don't know if I've ever mentioned it, but like this is Mississauga. So guys, it's all new to me. <laughs> oh, anyway, I I after the I was done from the bank, I went to a grocery store that I found nearby. Trust me to go with my bag anyway just in case so i picked this coleslaw mix this is a lot this is one of the <laughs> downsides to taking a new building like almost everything is still being tested i remember when we had just moved in as well to our toronto apartment we just randomly hear the um fire alarm go off because they are testing it but at least there, they, you get, you know, a voice notification sometimes to let you know that they're going to be testing it 90% of the time. <sighs> but then some other times, it will just randomly beep and go off. I don't know. This is the second time this one is happening. This one is so deafening. Oh my goodness. Anyway, I got this coleslaw mix. I was saying that this is a lot for three dollars 2.99 i got some scotch burning pepper and some chili peppers banana chicken breast and i got one mango tell me why ask me you why one mango typically i'll pick two but